and this recording is obviously discuss ama annuity payments made in advance um sometimes it happened it happens with the we save a money towards e example for not by phone what happens is um instead of you to be able to pay your money until you cash out the money at the end of the period of the annuity when you make a payment a month before the last payment a month before meaning you skip a month day one I will keep anything you will get you will get annuity account there sometimes it happens with it's two months before three months before it cashing out um, so this is one example so it demonstrated through a look at a timeline and then cool man now this annuity payments made in advance can be defined as the last payment in the annuity made one month before the investment is paid out this payment made in advance is the type of a future value future value annuity right What's so special about this one? It's that this one, instead of paying our annuities work until you cash out, Lana, uh, you make a payment in advance, meaning that you make your last payment a month before the investment is paid out, right? I'll demonstrate in an example with Kulumanga. Okay, now, 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 now. In the traditional example, yellow guys, a future value annuity. We make our payments until we cash out the money to from the savings or the investment account. So as such example, in order to sub to supplement his pension after retirement, Mpo aged twenty when I twenty years, we are seven, takes out the retirement annuity. I advise now, good now, Kalok Sevenza, have this retirement annuity. Unga slu pa bantu na ba kuna solo gans na so cool ala. He makes monthly payments of 2,000 rand into the fund and the payments start immediately, right? So this is a future value annuity problem, type of problem, but a payment is made in advance. Here's what I The payments are made in advance, which means that the last payment of 2,000 rand is made one month before the annuity pays out. The interest rate for the annuity is 15% per annum compounded monthly. Calculate the future value of the annuity when it turns 30. So, when I 20, when I 20, in 60 years time, um, when it turns 60, Uzo, when Zani, um, what's this one? The annuity is when Zani is mature. So, not 20 years. In 60, now say that 10 or 60, yeah, mature, right? Look, annuity, right? So, therefore, it means that from 20 to to 60, there's a 40 year difference, right? There's a 40 year difference. It means that the Maliaki was for 40 years. Yes? Okay. Let us create a timeline for this problem. So, T0. Where a vulali account the corner T1, T2, T3, all the way up to the last T, T1. What's this? T, T, let us calculate T1. So 34 T times 12. It's compounded monthly. So it's 480. <coughs> so you and Zama payments are 480. In fact, it's 481. In order to sub, okay. He makes monthly payments of 2000 rent into the fund and the payments start immediately. It means that Uvuli account 2000. The second month, we have 2000. Second month, we have 2000. Until, as I figure, go T. Four seven nine. Naga T four seven nine. Ufaga it two thousand. So this is the last payment I enzai. This is the last annuity I enzai. Agafagi imali lagu T forty eight. 
Why? Because the problem says the last payment is made one month before. This is an example of a payment made in advance. Sometimes it happens, Guti, the last payment is made two months before. Shuti, the last payment is made, Guti, Guti, um, seven, eight. But in our case, last payment is made, Guti, four, T, four, seven, nine, two thousand, nine, nine. Right? So it's one month before. So as count again. One, two, three, four. Okay, one, two, three. Oh, oh. That's like for now, value got n. The value for n is equal to what? It's going to be equal to t four. It's going to be four eighty, right? The last payment is going to be four seven nine. But there's an immediate payment, meaning we start counting from t zero. So therefore, sixteen ala parting eta u one. Whereby the first payment is made immediately. So that's why it is four seven nine plus one. You tell nobody u four eight zero. Okay, now then see a calculator. It's a future value x and then it's 1 plus i n minus 1 divided by i, right? i f is equal to f is equal to what's the value for x? 2000, 2000, and then it's 1 plus interest one fifteen percent so it's zero comma one five divided by twelve it's compounded monthly raised to exponent four eight zero minus one close bracket divided by interest to zero comma one five divided by twelve again bigger much this is the so nothing this is the last part again. Ama Luganj wa trita so. Ama payments made in advance wa trita so. Uzoti one um, plus uh, zero comma one five divided by twelve raised to exponent one month before the last payment right one month before the last payment one month before the last payment if the last the last payment was made two months before we saw the exponent two if it was made three months before the last payment big about exponent by three so basically we tata this part we are well multiplier so in payments made advance made in advance you multiply by the interest raised to the remaining number of months so future value is equal to as you calculate to 2000 1 plus 0 comma 1 5 divided by 12 close raised to exponent 480 minus 1 follow bracket 0 comma 1 5 divided by 12 this we are multiply la uh, one plus zero comma one five divided by twelve raised to exponent one. Answer whoa whoa sixty two million nice sixty two million eight oh seven eight oh seven um eight oh seven five ten 510 comma 92 92 so naimali as of the ni so this is a good retirement fund so yeah our payments made in advance with dealer now so okay you need to multiply by the interest raised to the exponent of the remaining number of months before the last payment so i hope we enjoy it in the description box so taller more examples on our annuities made in advance um check out the description box for any other content um related to financial mathematics like a grade 12. i hope you enjoy it like share and subscribe peace